2020 was challenging for everyone on and off the football field, but particularly tough in the City League. Teams played no non-conference games and their practices were limited. On top of all that, Bowser was implementing a new offense and dealing with a roster overhaul. The Blue Devil or the Blue Racers went one in four in that season, but as Joel Sebastianelli tells us, they're already seeing improvement in attitude and ability. What a difference a year makes? We'll see in the win column. Bowser went 1-4 in 2020, but this season already feels drastically different. Yeah, it was a trying year because we, we didn't, also didn't have a JV and a freshman schedule, so they practiced with us, but that kind of works to our advantage because we had them practicing with the varsity the, the entire time, so they were getting the same instruction, going through the same drills, uh, doing everything the same as everybody else. So we, we ch totally changed our offense last year, so they had to learn everything brand new. 49 varsity players fill out the roster, returning to the preferred practice schedule with time and the personnel to implement a refined offense. We changed the pistol. We ran some double wing last year, and we had changed the pistol, and, and we ran a combination of the two. We changed our blocking scheme. So it was much simpler. Uh, everything's a little bit more quicker hitting. And we're, we're now we are basically a run-oriented team in the past second. So uh, that's a big difference than what we've been in years past. All running backs from last year are back. Each wide receiver has varsity experience. Victor Reed will start at quarterback. He's very athletic, uh, uh, very smart guy. If the pass isn't there, he knows to run it. He's uh, he picked up on the offense really, really well can read the defensive secondary pretty well. I, and I have two good backup quarterbacks that if he does go down or something, God, for say, if something happens to him, uh, we should still be okay. Straight dots, <laughs> just straight dots all the time for every quarterback. They always throw straight dots. And I'm just excited for this year because they're so great. They're not just rallying behind the QB. Honestly, I feel like as a team, last year we didn't grow that much, but being this year, I feel like we've grown a lot from where we are in the summer to here where we're at now. I feel like we became much more of a team and working together. I was just starting last year, you know, learning a whole new offense, learning how to get into a groove, and then to where we're at now, everybody's knowing the playbook and working well together. They are picking things up quickly. They go all out of 100%. So like when we scrimmage Clay, Clay had, had big numbers there. They, they had some bigger guys up front, but our line was really, really aggressive and got after it. So, you know, I mean, that's what we're looking for. We just want aggressiveness. And then the fundamental thing we can kind of correct as we go along. Our team has heart. Our team works hard. We give a lot of effort. My last year or so, got to show out this year. I feel like everybody's counting us out right now, but hopefully once the ball kicks off, they'll see how we really are. At Bowser, Joel Sebastianelli, BCSN.